Yo, everybody, it's Loof Me here again today. We're gonna go on a manga haul. Uh, the homie just hit me up and said there was a restock at Barnes & Noble. So hopefully we're gonna get what we need today. So let's get on it. Shelves are looking nice, but we do have empty space. So let's see how much we could fill. All right, had to stop at the volume one table to see if they had anything new. I did look at the Parasite, opened it up, and the colored version looks really nice. And so I might actually give that a second chance. I said I wasn't going to get any more of those, but uh, it looked really nice to me. So, Oh, and then I saw Look Back, uh, Fujimoto's One Shot, and I was like, oh, cool, they put that out. That's uh, new. Well, it's not new, but Barnes & Noble just put that in. Mono, uh, monotone blue was looking at that looked pretty good still looking around seeing what they had new uh, the box sets nothing special so far but still the prices on them were a little cheaper this time around so that was cool the full metal alchemist hardbacks just came in and those are super super pretty I do have these versions though but I get a little bit more bang for my buck with those but over time I might change that up. And then I found Ghost in the Shell. I haven't seen this one out yet. Not at Mind Bars and Noble anyway, so that was kind of cool. That was a come up. Looking around. Oh, the Omnibus of Shaman King. They had the 4, 5, and 6. And I was like, oh yeah, baby. Might have to uh, cop that one real quick. Looking at it. It's looking clean. That was the only one they had. Just doing a little dive in, sweat and soap. They kind of tricked me here. I thought they had volume five, but uh, nope, just eight. They're, they're the same color. Spy Family, they did have number six, and it was a different color, strangely, than the other books. And I was like, huh, I wonder why that is. But, meh. And then still looking around. Uh, Call of the Night, they had volumes one and two. So I was like, yeah, I keep hearing good things about this. I'm going to have to pick this up. That's a no-brainer. So I got both of those. Yeah, pretty. Heavy quality, too. Good book. Still just looking. Akima Got Killed. They had three, four, five, and six. But I just wanted to get the third one today. Just because I haven't read throughout uh, the whole second one yet. And this is a little section that uh, section they put in it's like a little hidden section they put new releases and sometimes if you can't find something on the shelves it could be in this little hidden area right here they kind of try to hide it on purpose I guess for some reason uh, Twin Star Exorcist they didn't have volume 2 Undead Unluck uh, that was sitting up there when I found it and I was like oh okay cool Undead Unto 2 I'm gonna have to grab that that's a good series I like that one a lot so far Assassination Classroom. The binders on these are beautiful. I did watch the anime, but I I gotta collect these. They just look too cool. So I did end up picking volume one up today as well. Looking over at the Dr. Stone. Beautiful as always. Uh, I did hear that they are about to finish that in Japan, so I'm waiting on that for American. Uh, this book right here that was just super cool looking it was the history the visual history of Dragon Ball Z Dragon Ball in general but the, it was a little pricey I would have picked it up if it wasn't so pricey it was like 40 bucks and look at that volume one of uh, you know I got reincarnated Oh, that time I got reincarnated as a slime and I was like hmm my wife told me hey get into it so I was like ah okay why not I'll pick that up I did circle back around Alice in Borderlands 1 picked that up as well had to looking around uh, Dark Horse right there I had to look at it because I love uh, anything published by Dark Horse the Hellbound but then I was like eh, I'll save it for next time up and down uh, KC Comics, I always love uh, what they put out. KC Comics has really good stuff. So, High Rise Invasion, still need to pick some of those up for my brother because he's stuck on that. Uh, Hunter Hunter uh, had a lot more this time than they usually do. Usually they only have like one and two. So that was kind of nice to see. Just perusing around here. Looking good so far. 
See, this looked really interesting to me, so I might pick that up the next time. What is that? The Girl from the Other Side? I like the hardcover on it. It looked really cool. I didn't read the back of it. I should have read at least what it was about because I was really interested in that. So maybe next time I'll get that one. And then the Zelda too. I see a lot of Zelda. I didn't really know it was a manga for a long time, but flipping through it, I was like, oh, okay. You know, because I'm a big Zelda fan. I love the Ocarina of Time, uh, Majora's Mask, anything from the 64 era. Really good. And look at that, they did stock up on Mao again, so that was nice to see. Uh, that's picking up actually, a lot of people are getting into that one right now. Uh, this one looked really interesting to me, anything from SIG. I really want to get volume 1 of that Mob Psycho 100, but they never have it. Uh, I might have to order that, or maybe just wait till the next manga haul. So I went back over to the A's, I had to look around, and I think it's about that time guys. It is that time. I'm always talking smack, but I had to pick it up. I had to pick up volume one. We got to see what it's about. But overall, today was a success, everybody. It was really good. So let's go back home and figure it out. All right, we're back in the studio. Let's see what we got here today. Uh, we got Call of the Night 1 and 2. I was flipping through this, and I really like it. The quality of the book is really nice, and I think I'm going to thoroughly enjoy this. Uh, it has everything that I think I'm gonna like. So, vampires the whole nine, so very good. Uh, the wife told me to get this one. So, the time I got reincarnated as a slime. So that's gonna, I like the how thick it is too for the price too, the price wasn't bad. Uh, 13 bucks, so that one's a good one. Assassination Classroom, I watched the anime of this, but the binders on these just look great. And I think it's gonna be a nice, visual like when I'm all done because I think I'm going to complete this series so we got that Alice in Borderlands I had to take a double check around to find this because I didn't see it the first time when I walked around the volume one table so yeah my homie was right they did restock so I'm, I'm proud of that one I'm happy uh, we got Undead Unluck 2 still reading the first one but I do enjoy it it's nice we got Akima got kill three, cause yep, that's a hitter. Uh, Spy Family six, I usually get Spy Family over at Target, but we weren't in that part of town today. So I just settled for Barnes and Noble. And yeah, so that's a, that's a good one, cause they usually don't have this one. And then last but not least, I did give in, and I did get Attack on Titan, just because I got I got to see what the hype's about. I, I watched the anime, but I keep hearing the manga's better, so I'm gonna run with that. I did put the omnibus, the Shaman King, back, um, just because I I had a little bit of a price I wanted to stick to today, you know, and I, it came out good. So that's uh, today's haul right here. That's a, I think that's a pretty good haul for you know this week. And uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. I love all you guys very much. Uh, Loof meet out. Later, taters. I'll see you next time.